Hi, I'm Joe, KI4ASK, and I'm here with... Mary Catherine, KI4HHI. And we are doing the permanent orienteering course here at Panola Mountain State Park. The first four control points on this course apparently are rated beginner. The next few are intermediate, and the last group of them are advanced. So, okay, here we are at control point one. All right, checkpoint two. Okay, control we're point. on our way to control point three. And it's right up there. And there's Mary Catherine. We're at this trail intersection, which is right here on the map. Right there. And here we are on the pathway. All right, here we are. It says it's on the south side of a stone wall. There's the stone wall. Okay. So here we are, control point three. It's right there on the map. And you can see south side of stone wall, there is the stone wall. All right, we're climbing up this little hill here. Run through a little bit of briar. All right, so we're crossing this little trail segment here. You can see that here. And we're looking for an opening in the gate up ahead. And that's number four we're looking for. All right, here's the old road bed. And there's the gate up ahead that we are looking for right there. Okay, we're here at number four. There's Mary Catherine, hello MC. That's it for the easy control points. We're heading to number five which is way over here, and it looks like we've got a nice pathway here and a roadbed. So looking at the map, we're oriented, and that's one intersection, and there is the roadbed that's gonna take us to number five. And on the map, that's this heavy line here where I'm pointing, and then we'll traverse it over here into five. That All right, there's that little trail road intersection and Mary Catherine is navigating for us now and we're still en route to control point five okay so here's where we're at on the map where Mary Catherine's pointing you can see the intersection here is the intersection and you can also see this little building that's here and that's off in the woods right over there. So we are still in the right direction to control point five. Okay, we're in the general area of control point five. That's a fenced in area. There's a little goalie there. And there it is, control point five. Yay. Hey. So we are here at five, which is right over there. And we are heading to six next. So instead of bushwhacking the straight path, we're going to take this trail here, this old roadbed, and down to number six. So we're going that away. Lead on, Mary Catherine. Okay, so this was the intersection on the map. And now we're heading that away. En route to control point six. Here was my favorite orienteering buddy. Here we are, control point number six. Very good, navigation, Mary Catherine. Okay, so we're headed up this path across a bridge and down around to this building. It'll be on the right-hand side and our, our checkpoint should be to the left. All right, control point number seven. So this is actually part of the path network. So uh, one of those rare instances where we get to walk a paved path. Okay, so there's the whole barn. And here is control point seven. Yay. Yay. You can see the barn over there. 
Head, where are we heading to next? Number eight. Yep, so number eight's way over here. We're going to follow the path. It looks like we're gonna pass this this shaded means out of bounds which makes me think it's like private property somebody's somebody's home so it looks like maybe there's two houses there right and maybe some fencing or something or a driveway and or we'll go by something. that intersection there yep and then we'll once we get start getting close to the lake we need to head over right and we'll find it over okay. in the yeah that's a big open field and yeah. it's pretty close to uh control point one yeah across from yeah, near one. the bridge, yeah. Alexander Lakes. Okay, let's do it. Mm -hmm. All right, so this here. is the private property restricted area we saw on the map. You can see the red markings. And it looks like somebody's house is over there. So whenever you see those hash marks on an orienteering map, that is an out of boundary. Okay, here's the intersection that was on the map. There's the big open field. Should be down in the bottom of it. And there's Alexander Lake, and there's where we started. Okay, Cars park there, there, and there's the bridge. Um, okay, here we are. It's control point eight, although it's not labeled, we know it is. And it's this lone tree here, and a little bit of brush. So show us on the map where we're at, Mary Catherine. So we're right here, and you can tell, I, I knew that there was something right in the center of this field because of that yellow box and sure enough when i saw the tree i just came straight to it and there it was yep good job all right where are we going next okay so eight's here we've got to get all the way back over here so we're gonna backtrack and go back the way we came we can we have a choice to make we can go to the left at the barn and take this path right and then take a sharp right take or right to it we can go to stay on the path that we were on and then there's this trail right here that will also take us to it. So okay. we'll just have to make a judgment call when we get there. Okay, sounds good. All right, where are we off to next? We're here at the the barn and that's right. right there on the map. Yep, and I'm gonna make the executive decision to stay on this path that's in front of us. Okay. And take it up to um, where uh, we were we're at we, for six. six. Yeah. Yep. And there's an intersection there we can take. And this looks like it could be boulders. I'm not positive, but something like that. That'll get us close to and nine. And we'll go up the hill a little bit. But okay. it's before we get to the bridge and the yeah. chimneys. Okay. Sounds good. Lead yeah. the way. Okay. All right. So we made it back to uh, checkpoint six. And this is the little trail we were looking for right here to the left it's on the opposite side of checkpoint six which was right here yeah there, there's six over there you can kind of see it so we're just going to take this little trail and it looks like we're going to pass some boulders along the way but that that six of uh, that nine should be in between two boulders okay once we get there lead the way Boulders that I see on the map. Okay, so here we are. We're getting ready to. So we started seeing boulders. We got this one to the right of the trail up here. Up there, yep. And then we've got another one across right from there, it. Across from it, and which, that's which, where on the map? Right here. So yep. we've got the one to the right yep. and then the one across from it. So and I think, right up there. I think we're headed to these guys right up here and we're going to find okay. the checkpoint. Let's head up the hill. Yep. Onward to control point number nine. You think you're there and yep. All right, so we crossed through some boulders, but we still got a little ways to go up there. Okay, here we are. Control point number nine. All right, Mary Catherine, good job navigating us. Yay. I'm king of the mountain. Queen of the mountain. <laughs> Or you can be the king, either way. Either way. All right, Queen of the Mountain, what's our plan? Okay. We're heading to 10, right? We are headed to 10, we're, we're at nine. So uh, we're right here. Those are the two boulders we just came to. And you can tell by the terrain on the map, these, these lines are really close together. That was a steep climb Yes. We, we made to get up here. So we're kind of at the top, but we can get to this other path if we just go up and over. 
Right. So we're gonna, we're just gonna walk a little bit. I don't think it's gonna be far and we're gonna find that path. We're gonna take a left and come down to this path, this intersection. Generally going south, yep. Yep, and then, and then we'll come back to the barn. East. Like we're going to the barn and then yeah. it'll be on our right hand side okay we won't get to the barn but very good do we want to shoot an azimuth from here to the trail uh we can yeah sure my map. so that the edge is right here with my line the, di the direction of travel right. nine to ten i'm going to take my thumb compass i'm going to line it up to that line on the map yep that'll be our direction yep. of travel and then i want to orient myself so that i'm uh north is uh behind me right yep so i'm gonna go so north is behind me this is north this is south and the map and is the north map. so we're oriented so yep. we're oriented and then we're gonna go to the left here and that's our direction of travel and that's our direction ahead. of travel yeah okay let's do it and here comes mary catherine emerging from the woods victorious we had to bushwhack our way up and down that little valley but we are now here back on the trail still in route to control point number 10. But now we know where we're at on the map. Yeah. Now we know we're at on the map. Okay, so we were we were at nine and um, we worked our way to this path. This this is a, a big, nice big path to follow. Yeah, this right here. To get yep. us to uh, checkpoint 10. And um, we've passed a couple of boulders along the way. You can see them here. We weren't exactly sure what this was. We knew it would be on the right-hand side of the trail and it'd be and, prominent. And kind of in a saddle, that's high ground and that's high ground. Yep. So there's high ground and that starts sloping upward. Yeah, so we, we think it's this uh, rock right here that's kind of elongated. Yep. Um, it's almost like it's a, a boulder on the end with a little line, so. Yep. okay. Um, maybe so we're getting close to 10 cliff, then. Cliff-like kind of. Yeah, so we're getting close to 10, so we'll, uh, We'll keep walking and 10. We'll shoot an azimuth maybe from that. Yeah, if we, if we open up the map, we'll see. We could we could follow the path all the way around and back up. So we could go all the way down to the barn. Well, we could right just do up. that because we got to go to 11 on the other side of the creek anyway. We could, or we can we can just bushwhack. bushwhack. This doesn't look like it's hilly to nope. me. It's not too hilly. It's the side of a, uh, a spur. So. Yeah, so we could... We could walk through there if we can. Uh... All right, so we'll see if we can find that boulder. And it's the, really the same bearing that we. Okay, so what we're trying to do is cut the tangent here to 10. So we think we're here at this boulder. If you see right there on the map, there's a, a couple of boulders to our left. That's where we think we're at on the map. So if we take this line, shouldn't be very far we can cut the tangent to 10 and it'll be a lot quicker than going down and around the path. Yeah, I agree. Issue. All right, so let's get oriented so we so know where north is. So we need is. to turn here. All right, so red points to the top of the map and we got the direction of travel. So we're gonna go right through right there. through here, yeah. All right, let's do it. Okay, so we just kind of went through the woods there and yay, there's number 10. <laughs> and we're back on the other side the path that was running parallel to this. Yep. Okay, so we're here at 10. We did a little bushwhacking to get here. Um, it didn't take us too long to find it. It was closer to the, to the trail than we thought it was going to be. But, uh, you know, that's just that's just part of the game. It's hard to tell sometimes. So what we're going to have to do is get across the lake here. We're going to have to fo follow this path, take the bridge over to the other side. And then once we get to this sharp turn right here in the map, we're gonna need to uh, do a little uh, orienteering to get bushwhacking to get to that point. So I'll take a, 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 bearing. a bearing when we get over there to kind of find it once we get to All that right, point. So what are we looking for at control point 11? So we're looking for a gully junction. Okay. So you There's can see the here's symbols. the foot symbols right there. All right, and it looks like it's gonna be in the northwest corner of, of those. So that, yeah. that lines up with the map because an orienteering map always points north. Okay, well, let's follow the trail. And then when we get to that curve on the other side of the lake, we will take a bearing. I actually think that bridge, if I remember correctly, is a boardwalk. It's pretty long. So we'll see. Here we go. Onto the trail. Okay, bunch of boulders right here yep. to our south. And where's that on the map, Mary Catherine? So you can see we've actually seen a lot of boulders on both sides of the trail. 
Yeah. But we're probably down in here. We're probably that's, getting that's ready. Right. Yeah. That's right. We're probably getting we're ready to lose them. We're going to go down to this boardwalk. So we've got all those boulders, and you can see them right there. Okay, so we're approaching the lake and the boardwalk. So we can see the sign there and the boardwalk up ahead. Mm. Where are we at on the map, Mary Catherine? So we're right about here on the map. We're going to yep. go over the over the water here, over the boardwalk, and then uh, find that uh, curve curve mm -hmm. bend in the in the path, and and then we'll shoot our which is probably bearing. right up over there. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Yep, close. Lead the way. <laughs> All right, we're on the boardwalk. There's Alexander Lakes. Actually, we started the course way over there and we parked the car there. So we're heading that way. We just came from that way. Okay, so we've taken the trail to this bend. Yep. We came from the boardwalk here. So what are we doing next? Yep, so 10 was over here, took the path, crossed the boardwalk, and now we're in this sharp bend right here. And I am going to take my compass and line it up. That's 11. I know you can't see the 11. I've got it folded over, but that circle is where 11 is. So I'm going to take my compass and line it up there. I'm going to make sure that my map is oriented north. And then we're going to go the direction of this black line. Okay, right there. It looks like there might be... An little bit of a entry point into the forest here. Yeah. Okay, lead the way. Okay, so this one was described as at the intersection of two gullies. So there it is, number 11, and there's gully one and gully two, and here comes Mary Catherine. Cool. Yep. All right, here we are at control point 11. Yay. Hey. The intersection of these two gullies. We are at 11. And there's 11. So we are going to 12. <laughs> we are going to bushwhack because there's no easy path. So here's the path that we've been on, that paved path up here right. squiggling around. That's where we came from. We, we can't use that to find 12. We're just going to have to bushwhack. So I folded my map. I've gotten my compass lined up with the line of travel here mm -hmm. and then i'm gonna turn to face north <laughs> okay and so we're gonna kind of go up that way yeah so we're gonna follow this uh gully really for a little yeah, bit we're gonna follow the gully all right let's do it going from 11 to 12. okay good job that was all azimuth and bushwhacking That's control okay. point number 12. good job navigating mary catherine yeah, we came up from there, and then on the map, there's some boulders up ahead, and then the road is down off this hilltop. Yeah, so what we did was we found the boulders, and then we came back and found the checkpoint, because we knew yep. once we found those boulders that it had to be behind them, closer to the top. Yep, very good. Okay, let's log it. Hey, control point 13. Hey, Mary Catherine. Hey. And it was near a carn, and there it is, a little rock pile. And show us where we're at on the map. Okay, let's see. All right, so we're at 13, which is right here. That's the current on the map. Mm -hmm. We came from here. Yep. So we bushwhacked down this uh, hillside, mountain, whatever you want to call it. And this is a good example of how you can be really, really close, but no cigar. Because we went all the way down to the path. And we had to backtrack. And we had to bit. backtrack. We had to get on the path and kind of reorient ourselves and come back up and find the actual checkpoint. We knew when we saw this green space. Which we'll pass up there. It's, yeah. When we we'll got see it on off the, the trail. Distance. When we got on the trail and we could see the green space ahead, we knew we had to go back and, and find the, the, the carn. So. All right. So we only have one more control point to find. And it's that little spot in the middle of that open field. And what does it say on the map? All right. Bend in the path. It's a bend in the path, and then that'll be yeah, it. That's our last it. control point. So all we have to do is go back down to the path. We know exactly where that's at. Get on the path, walk around, go to the bend in the path, and we should have checkpoint 14. All right, sounds good. Lead the way. All right. Okay, so here's this big open field here, and on an orienteering map, 
that's designated by orange and so yeah it's this area here and we're heading to 14 there which is another open field area straight ahead all right we should be getting close there's alexander lake here's the open field and it should be in these trees right up here hey okay, here we are last control point there you go. O -U -T. yay All right, we just finished the course. It was 14 control points, uh, about a total of five miles, and we had a lot of fun. And Mary Catherine did most of the navigating. Good job. It was fun. It was a good mix of easy and then a couple of challenge, challenging ones at the end. So Yeah, we, uh, we enjoyed it. Thanks for tuning in, and we will create more videos of ham radio, orienteering, and lots of other stuff. 7-3 and bye-bye. Three, two, one. All right, so we're gonna use. Oh, hello, butterfly. And Mary Catherine, it's over here to your left, Mary Catherine. All right, we've got the giggles now. We've got the giggles. All right, let's see if we can get our I act to together. I orient myself. Where's north? <laughs> Let me look at the picture of it. <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> Nothing. I know better, okay. <laughs>